Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Darko from TV Calibration with Darko and in this video I will show you settings for gaming on Samsung JU6572 Ultra HD TV for 2015. This TV offers game mode but to enable it you need to go to system, then general and here you see game mode which is off by default and this will give you over 100 millisecond input lag but when you enable it input lag will fall to 27.2 27.3 milliseconds which is much much better result okay let's go to picture so by default when you enable game mode you are in picture mode game and you cannot change this picture by default is not very precise there is too much blue gamma is too low and overall brightness is too high so this is my combination for around 200 nits which should be for both daytime and nighttime gaming of course you can increase or decrease backlight depending on your preferences and room light conditions i reduce contrast to 90 to get more smooth grayscale brightness 44 sharpness 0 increase it if you like i enjoy it at default zero because then no artificial sharpening is introduced these two settings are at their default values picture size 16 by 9 and fit to screen auto if it is off you will lose edges of the picture so on or auto let's go down to advanced settings here you see color space custom i did small tweaks to certain colors i'll go i'll start with red then green blue yellow cyan magenta and that's it okay going to white balance only two point white balance controls are available but that is more enough to get really precise grayscale as you can see there was too much blue and by increasing red and reducing blue i managed to get really accurate grayscale gamma minus one picture options here you will see very important thing HDMI black level should be not at auto or low, but at normal for RGB 444 full range signal. For instance, as when you connect your PC or game console. And basically this is it. So with game mode on and these tweaks, picture is really nicely balanced. And of course, there are some limitations in terms of motion resolution and also contrast is only around 2000 to 1. But because of the curved screen, uh, first person shooters, FPS games look really good. You really get feeling of depth. That's all for this video, thank you for watching, if you have any questions or comments, I'm here, please leave a comment or send me a message. Bye!